Hi guys, Steffi here and welcome back to the channel. Um, today, yeah, I'm, I'm surprised you're not getting sick of me, but it's <laughs> been nothing for ages and then just, you know, video overload. Um, but yeah, it is day number 11 of um, the 12 days of Advent that I'm doing with the lovely Amy, who is all things crafty with Amy here on YouTube. Please find the uh, link in the description bar below. And go on over and show us some love. Although I'm, I'm sure you probably already have since we're on day 11 now. Oh my god, only one more day to go. Like, can you believe it? I'm so excited. I'm so excited to, to see what she, like, what she thinks of all of these, honestly. And so excited to get the stuff back as well. Like, she makes some of the most amazing things. So, today we have this large gift box. And I've used the sugar cookie again. Um, I used the sugar cookie on day five and um, when I'd done the cracker box and this is beautiful. This box, you know, I don't even think I've given you the measurements on any of the videos, you know. Um, this is about seven and three quarters squared and so I've got matted it with the lovely green, mint, mint green cardstock there. Um, this um, snowflake yeah, circle thing. <laughs> yeah, this embellishment um was out of our stash. It's a beautiful die. So fiddly getting our little bit out, but it's absolutely beautiful. Then we've got some pieces of the ephemera. And I don't know, yeah, you can see I've I've stickles, I've got stickles everywhere, Amy, for you. Stickles, stickles, galore. Um so we've got the pink deer there with the beautiful mint bow. Um, got the happy holidays I've just matted that onto a bit of the green just to make it stand out a little bit and then these are a mixture of Prima I don't know if they're the actual sugar cookie ones I think some of them will be but I put all my flowers in together like the all in a big massive jar and I just put them all in there Um, went around with some stickles on some of them these three I don't know if that's picking up yeah it is these little cream blossoms, I've used these in a couple of other um, projects and these are from Home Bargains. Then I had these little like swirls, gem swirls, and I've just cut into them and I've just popped a couple going around there. And then we've got the cookies and stuff on the side. And then I've even decorated the base and we've got me, me handmade stamp there. Um, now this idea came from Michelle Allen. Um, she does some amazing things. I think hers was slightly smaller, um, but like I love the concept. So this wrap here, it's like almost like making an album. So this is chipboard, and then the inside is card. Um, I've used this beautiful ribbon here. It's like a, almost like a like a diamondy effect. This was I got this for ages ago from stamping up on when it was on clearance. So I'm going to undo my bow, which I could cry. And inside you've just got, she could put a, I don't know, she could put a photo or something here if she really wanted to. Um, or she could just leave it plain. And then inside, this is such a snug fit. Wait, I'll get me, me nails on to get it out. Because um, I made it to size this. So I'll just take that out so you can see the inside of the box. And everything has been double matted. This is 300 GSM cardstock, and then we've got the card layer, and then we've got the paper on each side, apart from the back. And, I mean, just look how gorgeous that is. She could use that to pop anything in, really. Little keepsakes, Christmas crafty bits, or anything. Um, but I love this. Um, and this is the villains. It's a cauldron bath fizzer. Um and a poison apple shaped sponge and I was like oh my god like this just appeals to me on so many different levels Um, the bath fizzer smells like apple and yeah I just saw these and I was like these are amazing like I, I had to pick them up there was no if why buts about it I had to I just loved it Um, but yeah it's it's I just love it and it didn't take that long to put this together actually I think the hardest thing for me on any project I do is deciding how to decorate it. And the flower, oh, I saw that point later. The flowers, honestly, like 
for something that looks so simple on here, it took me ages to decide how I was going to do this, how I was going to decorate it. Give me an, al an album base, I can, you know, knock them up so quickly now. But when it comes to actual decorating, I'm a nightmare. I really am. But anyway, that's enough waffling. <laughs> Sorry, I went a bit off, off track there, didn't I? Um, but yeah, this is my project for Amy and for day number 11. And I do love it. And I think she's going to love it as well. Um, so yeah, last day tomorrow, guys. Um, but I hope you've been enjoying it so far. Um, I really do. Um, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you want any a tutorial doing for this, I could maybe look at doing one in the new year. Obviously, it wouldn't be in Christmas thing, but you, you could give this for, you could change it up, make a birthday, Valentine's, new baby, or anything like that. So, yeah, if you want to like to see a tutorial, just let me know in the comments below, and I will probably give on to that in the new year for you. Thank you very much for watching, guys, and I'll see you tomorrow.